Hey guys, Jigga, Ashley here, and I'm here with Review It Sunday, the third one. Um, and I am here with an exclusive, cannot wait to tell you about this book. Um, this book is A Pound of Flesh. Let's pause for a screenshot. <laughs> um, and it is by Sophie Jackson. It is 432 pages. And it was amazing. Um, I bought this book. I hadn't really heard. I saw one review about it. Just talking kind of what it was about. It was like Orange is New Black. They said kind of like a little bit like that. Um, so I was like, oh, I'll pick it up and try it. And I wasn't in the mood for contemporary or erotic novels or anything like that. And I picked this book up and I read it in four days because it's a big book. So I read like 100 pages each day. And I just finished it today, um, which I'm pre-filming. <laughs> Okay. multi command which I'm pre-filming because this is actually going to be filmed Friday, but I'm going to upload it on Sunday. Um, so I finished it coming on June, July 24th. And I just wanted to say that this was an amazing book. Loved it. And let's get into, first of all, the cover is just so beautiful. Can you look at that cover? It's so pretty. So, so pretty. Um... And it's, like I said, this is the first time I read this author, and I loved it. Um, the story follows two main characters, Kat and Carter. I think it's Carter. Carter, but his name is Wes, but they call him Carter. He has just got sent to prison, um, and he, this is no spoilers, so don't worry, this is a spoiler for you view. He's been sent to prison at, I forget what it was called, Kill, Kill Something, and, um, Kill. You read the book? I forgot what I think it's Arthur Kill, um, in New York City, and he got sent there. Um, and Kate is a lit teacher, and she goes there to teach the students. And you know, it's like I said, it's not a spoiler at all. But her father ends up getting murdered. He's a senator. He gets killed right in front of her. Um, and so every time, she, every night, she has nightmares all the time. And she really can't go to bed, and she's just a really, I felt so bad for her. She's a really lovely, love, lovable character, I can't the word, but she's so torn and so damaged, and she kind of just goes on her day, like, she wants to teach these kids because that's a promise that she made for her dad was to teach, you know, kids that needed the help. So she meets Carter, or Wes. And they form a teacher student relationship, like nothing bad. Um, he finds out, which I'm not gonna give away, finds out something about her, which puts everything in motion. And it's just, it's, it's so good. There's just, there's darkness, there's romance. She writes so eloquently. I can't even put into words how much, how good it is to kind of read that. Um, and even the sexy time scenes were very classy. They were not trashy like some other authors, you know, that you guys all read or know. It was done so eloquently, so classy is all I can say. And it was just, the writing was beautiful. The story was beautiful. I gave it four stars out of five just because I wanted more of Wes's background. And I really didn't get that. I got more of Kate's background. And I love Wes as a character. You know, he is a bad boy, but... By that saying bad boy, really no. He owes a pound of flesh. And I love the title of the book because it fits the book so well. And it just, the story, once you read it, you'll understand why it's called a pound of flesh. But it's just an amazing story. And I can't really say much more because I don't want to spoil you guys. If you have read it, comment down below so we can talk about it because it was an amazing book. And I will see you back here. I have a book haul. So actually, that will probably be before this. But I will see you guys later. Like we always say, keep calm and read on. Bye, guys.